Hello everyone. Hi. I pray that you are having a blessed day in the Lord. Praise God. Hallelujah. God is good. Come on somebody all by himself. Glory, glory, glory. You know, um, truth be told, I've got a lot of people that in inbox me and actually message me about, um, they say, talk more about the election. Talk more about what's going on. Well, I'm not that type of apostle and prophet and you're not going to like what I'm going to say in the beginning, but trust me, it gets better. And this is a Rima word from God. But let me tell you something. You have to be very careful because right now, a lot of people, even famous prophets, apostles, bishops, evangelists, ministers, people are capitalizing on the moment of hysteria, on the moment of frustration, on the moment of just um, uh, awareness of what's going on. You understand the uneasiness, the, the, the testing, the, I mean, it, it's a lot happening right now. It's a lot that is happening in the spiritual realm for more in the natural realm. Come on somebody. Hallelujah. So be careful for those that are just seeking, um, to, you know, they know people need a word in this hour. Come on somebody. Hallelujah. They know people are unsettled in this hour. Come on somebody. Hallelujah. So they're capitalizing, you know, putting themselves on the map. Come on somebody. Hallelujah. Y'all, you know what exactly what I'm talking talking about so be careful always listen to anybody I don't care if it's to me listen with the spirit of God not just listen I want you to hear hear with your spirit see let me tell you what's really going on you got to get to a point where you understand what's happening in the spirit not just in the natural the natural you will move in the natural you'll think in the natural you'll react in the natural God this is testing so let me tell you what God told me I was actually, I was in my quiet place and I said, God, what is going on? Because even I feel it, it's a lot of pressure, you know, excuse me, even through the happiness I feel of everything that has recently happened, I feel the pressure, I, 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 I feel the fear, I feel the anger, I feel, I feel it. And I said, God, what is going on? He said, Deanna, tell my people, this is a level of testing that I am allowing. Come on somebody. Hallelujah. Everything ain't the devil. Come on somebody. Everything ain't the devil. God say, I am allowing this because there's a levels of glory. Come on somebody. And he said, I'm looking throughout the earth in this season that who will seek me instead of seeking. Come on somebody. I'm going to go there. When things happen, what do we do? Either we seek a man, a woman, alcohol, drugs, anger. Come on, somebody. You, you spew out. You spew out because you don't know what's happening and you don't know how to just pray and stay. Come on, somebody. Hallelujah. Pray and stay. So God said, he said, no, 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 no. What you have to learn and get to a level. He said, I'm calling my people home to me. No, no, no. We're not talking about in the natural. We're talking about in the spirit. He said, they don't know me. They have not known of me. So therefore, they don't understand when my glory is over the world. They don't understand that the reason why the enemy is acting so crazy, because my glory, hallelujah, is all over the world. And I'm looking for the ones and the carriers of it. Oh, this thing is deep. You better listen to what I'm saying. Because there are remnant that carry the glory of God, that carry the presence of God. Through everything. Come on somebody. Let's go. Through generation through generation. From Noah to the, the New Testament. When Jesus. The apostles. The disciples. Joshua. Moses. Abraham. David. They were carriers of his glory. And they went through it. Come on somebody. Hallelujah. Absalom was trying to kill David. Come on somebody. Do you understand? In each generation. There was devastation. But. In that devastation, there was carriers of the glory of God. He's saying what's happening is the enemy don't like that. So what he's doing is he's causing turbulence. But what he don't know is that God said, I'm, I, I want it to get caused. Because what I'm going to do is I'm going to enlarge their territory spiritually, not just naturally. Oh, come on, somebody. Hallelujah. There's an army. Hallelujah. That's arising in this hour. So, so I know you see what's happening. I know you see the hate. I know you see the anger. But in this... God said he's preparing our people to carry the glory. Because in this next level, and if you don't see it, they're playing too many games. So that means the enemy is getting ready to show his hand. Anytime there's confusion, the way it is, frustration, it's on purpose. And, and it's di it, it, what it is is diversions. Come on, somebody. Hallelujah. You better understand what I'm saying. They're diverting their attention this way, that way, so they can move another way. But God said, through all of that, I need my people to focus on me. Hallelujah. Don't be focusing on what's going on outside. 
He said, I need you to focus what's going on inside. Because that's the enemy's plan. It's to divert and to distract. Come on, somebody. But God said, I'm going to use that to extract. Oh, hallelujah. You don't hear what I'm saying. He said, I I'm putting something down deep into those that will carry the glory. Hallelujah. That's where miracle signs and wonders. Come on, somebody. We're talking about something that always happens from generation to generation. Every time there's devastation. Oh, come on, somebody. And even when they do what they do, because they're going to do it. There's always miracle signs and wonders. Come on, somebody. Let me, let, let's go here. Let's go back to the, to Moses. Oh, come on, somebody. Pharaoh had to be Pharaoh so Moses could be Moses. But God said, in each generation, I raise up a deliverer. Hallelujah. He said, so I, I, I won't fail you. Pharaoh will be Pharaoh. They got to do what they do. He said, but what I need my people is to do what they do. Hallelujah to his name. God's looking for some Moseses. God's looking for some Joshua's. God's looking for some Caleb's. God's looking. He said, you worry about the wrong thing. Worry about what you possess in the inside. Because it'll stop the enemy on the outside. Hallelujah to his name. See, you got, you got your fake people on here to, to, trying to get the glory. Oh, hallelujah. But, that, but getting the glory is not just having likes and everybody to follow you on Facebook. Come on, somebody. He said, getting the glory is freeing my people. Of bondage, of yokes, of hurt, of pain. He said deliverance and healing is in the midst in this hour. Hallelujah to his name. He said, but I need the glory carriers to come forth. And that's why the pressure been on you too. Come on somebody, let's talk about that. You remnant carriers, you glory carriers, that's why you've been feeling so much pressure. Because God says he's pushing that all out of you. That all, that all, come on somebody. That same all that allows your head. Oh, come on somebody. The same power that allows your head. Allows your head so much power that when they threw a dead soldier on them, what happened? Oh, hallelujah. He shook and healed. He got up. And, and I mean, people were scared because they just threw him and they left. But when they saw him, they got scared. They said, he lives. Can these bones live? Oh, hallelujah. So you got to go past what the enemy is showing you. Oh, come on, somebody. You got to go past what the enemy is showing you. Because God said, I'm showing my glory. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Because I felt it too. I said, God, it, 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 it's a little tight. What's going on? Hallelujah. And, 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 and people don't know what to do. God say, you know what to do. Get still. Be calm. And get before him and pray. He said, I am the great I am. I am all powerful. Hallelujah. He said, and I'm the still God of yesterday, today, and forevermore. Hallelujah. I don't care what the enemy do. I don't care how he try to do it. I don't care how he try to come. Oh, come on, somebody. I'm reminded of Paul and Silas. Even when they was in the jail. Oh, come on, somebody. They started singing. And what happened? Oh, come on. All of the cells broke. And that's the glory that God is getting ready to come on, somebody, to move in this hour. He's everybody got delivered because they knew in the midst of turbulence I must pray that's glory carriers don't get out of whack don't get all angry don't start attacking oh come on somebody hallelujah they started glorifying hallelujah the Lord thy God and he said that's what I'm looking for that's what I'm looking for he said now I can move hallelujah through the earth in power hallelujah hallelujah God is waiting so it's time for us the remnant to stop this foolishness and let God be God. Because here's the deal. The enemy can't do nothing that God don't allow. So this pain, this strain, this frustration that you all feeling right now. Is God pushing you into your destiny. Hallelujah. He said who will carry the glory. Hallelujah. 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 And, and, and this ain't for you ones that just want attention and a platform. These are the ones that have the heart of God. They are the children of God. They will do what Jesus did. They will cast out demons. They will heal the sick. They will raise the dead. Hallelujah. I've seen this. I've seen the glory of the Lord thy God. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. I've seen it. And I know it should come to pass. Yes, a lot of hard stuff is happening. And there's a lot more going to happen. He said, but in the midst, I will show myself mighty as always. If you know, every generation, every generation, when things happen, God showed himself to be God all by himself. Our position is to obey and pray and stay in position. Hallelujah to his name. So God bless you. I feel the spirit of God. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. This stuff real. Let me tell you something. Don't you dare get this made, God say. Don't you dare. Let me tell you something. The enemy wants people to act crazy because he knows if you're acting that way, then you're not carrying the glory. Hallelujah. 
But if you become peaceful and lay your face before the Lord thy God, come on somebody, hallelujah, I feel the power that will ignite you is the same power that ignited Jacob. Come on somebody, let me tell you something. How could Jacob wrestle against an angel, a powerful entity of God and win? He said, I'm not going to let you go until you bless me. That was a power that Jacob stirred up inside of him. Hallelujah. That made the angel say, I'm going to have to hit him on his side for him to let me go. Even the power, the angel, the angel was like, wait a minute, he went. How could a flesh be an entity, which is the angel? That's because Jacob knew. Jacob got sick and tired of being sick and tired and Jacob surrendered to the power that was on the inside and when he did that because he's in God he said greater is he that is in you than he that is in the world so once you surrender to the power on the inside the outside got to bow down hallelujah to his name children of God gird up your lines act like a man and woman of God come on somebody hallelujah God's people have not been weak have never been weak as a matter of fact truth be told God said, this is, the gener this is the weakest generation, but the strongest generation. Now, how could that be? Because guess what? You're acting weak, but you don't know that you're strong. Hallelujah to his name. You better tap in what's side of you. Hallelujah. Jacob tapped into it. He, he tapped into it. Come on, somebody. Hallelujah. But you got to believe it. You will receive nothing from the Lord unless thou believe. Where are you, glory carriers, God say? Where are you that would carry the glory? Hallelujah. I feel the spirit of God. I'm so hot up in here right now. Hallelujah. My, my, my. You have no idea. This God is doing something. Do not be dismayed. I heard him say it. Do not fear. Because if you think God is going to let the enemy overtake his people, then you have not read the Bible. Hallelujah to his name. So God bless you. This is Apostle Deanna Dixon with a bream word from God. Where are you, God said. Seek his glory because this is the, he's taking you from level to level to level. And no, 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 it don't get easy. Sorry. Whoever lied to you, they lied. That means you got to come up, come up in your prayer, your fasting. Stop, stop being with Pookie and Nene. If you know they ain't following God. Hallelujah. That's how y'all getting tainted. Y'all in and out. One minute you want to be with God, next minute you want to do something else. Come on, somebody. It has to be some consistency. That's how you, that's how you stay in the presence of God. That's how you carry the presence of God. Hallelujah. He must be first in every aspect of your life. I don't care who come, what come. Hallelujah. So God bless you. I have to go teach my class. I love you. And this is Apostle Deanna Dixon. Roll out, soldiers. Mm -hmm.